Hogwarts Legacy releases early enough in 2023 that DLC could arrive later in the year. To be clear, there has been no announcement or confirmation of any post-launch DLC for Hogwarts Legacy. But if Avalanche is indeed planning any currently unannounced DLC for the game, it would not be out of the realm of possibility to anticipate it for later in the year. The game's launch being so early in the year gives Avalanche quite a bit of time to develop a narrative expansion or significant update for Hogwarts Legacy, and even a holiday patch with seasonal goodies could land within 2023. Experience Hogwarts in the 1800s Your character is a student who holds the key to an ancient secret that threatens to tear the wizarding world apart. You have received a late acceptance to the Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry and soon discover that you are no ordinary student, you possess an unusual ability to perceive and master ancient magic. Only you can decide if you will protect this secret for the good of all, or yield to the temptation of more sinister magic. Discover the feeling of living at Hogwarts as you make allies, battle dark wizards, and ultimately decide the fate of the wizarding world. Your legacy is what you make of it. Rather, because Avalanche may be busy with the game's release on Nintendo Switch, PS4, and Xbox One, there may not be time available to launch any DLC within the year. Otherwise, if a Hogwarts Legacy sequel is planned or in development later in 2023, it would be incredibly unlikely for it to be announced within the year whether the game is successful or not. Hogwarts Legacy is an upcoming open-world action role-playing game set in the late 19th century within the Wizarding World. Developed by Avalanche Software and published by Warner Brothers Interactive Entertainment under the Portkey Games label, the game is scheduled for release on February 10, 2023 on PlayStation 5, Xbox X, S, and PC, April 4, 2023 on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One and July 25, 2023 on the Nintendo Switch. So far, it seems that the gameplay will include detailed character creation, spell casting, exploration, stealth, and elements of both the action and role-playing genres. As it is common for non-free console and PC games, no system of microtransactions will be used, unlike the similar mobile game Harry Potter, Hogwarts Mystery. The player will be able to develop their own dueling style by combining different spells. They will also be able to make specific allies. It is implied, though not confirmed, that it will be possible to become a dark wizard or witch instead of following a hero path. The game will be set in the Scottish Highlands, including Hogwarts and a vast territory around it. Broom flight will be used to reach farther locations, which will include wizard villages such as Hogsmeade. The developers have also confirmed a fast travel system known as Flu Flames. The scenery and other environments will be highly detailed and intricate, weather events will affect the environment, and the four climatic seasons will be reflected in the landscape. The Hogwarts Legacy release date is set for February 10, 2023, for PS5, Xbox Series X, and PC. There will be a 72-hour early access period beginning on February 7, 2023, for pre-order customers. There has, however, been a Hogwarts Legacy delay for PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch players. WB Games says that PS4 and Xbox One players will need to wait until April 4, 2023 to play Hogwarts Legacy, while the Switch version will come out July 25, 2023. Citing a reason for the delay, opens a new tab, the publisher says the team is looking forward to bringing you the game and we want to deliver the best possible game experience across all platforms. Warner Brothers Games has set the Hogwarts Legacy platforms as PS5, PS4, Xbox Series X, Xbox One, PC, and Nintendo Switch. We have already seen the Hogwarts Legacy system requirements for PC and they caught some players off guard. This has led to speculation that the Nintendo Switch version, which remains without a release date, will be a cloud game, this has yet to be confirmed, but we're expecting more clarity on this in the weeks ahead.